Hey loves, so today we will be checking out Westman Atelier's Squeaky Clean Liquid Lip Balm. We will be checking out all the hues, there's six in total in the collection, in outdoor lighting as well as indoor lighting. I'll also let you know how it's been performing because of course I've been testing it out for a couple of weeks. So this is going to be a tinted kind of lip gloss balm. It's a clean formula. It's high shine. There isn't a stickiness to it. So you don't have to fear about like your hair getting like all, all over your <laughs> lips getting stuck because it actually happens to me. It's hydrating and it's a nice, really kind of soothing, cushiony liquid formula. I don't have anything on my lips now. So what's so great about Gucci's packaging is that it's absolutely chic, it is luxurious. This is actually quite heavy. So if you're trying to like carry all six for like an event, I would just do one or two, it's very heavy. Because I like to use glosses on their own as well as a topper for lipstick. What's great about this is it has this wonderful window. When you are low, you're gonna know. And I absolutely adore that because it's beautiful, it's chic, the packaging is gorgeous and it's expensive. But I know it has a functional little window here that lets you know when it's time to buy another one. It's actually her team is, her team's pretty brilliant. I have to give it to them. The sizing of things, the heaviness, the weight of her packaging on each makeup item, I'm just always blown away. Oh, and let me eat before. So it feels like, I feel like this is glass. Let's see. So it has this like sea glass kind of matte and then the top is shiny and it has a beautiful velvet detail. They just have the details so down. I'm just appreciative because I know where my money is going. Um, and then it has this really pretty paddle. I enjoy because I can apply on the side as well as flat. It's like a paddle doe foot. It's really cute. Okay, so this one is the shade Nana. Nana is a cool beige and this is supposed to be a great lip gloss color for everyone. I can lay the paddle down on my lips, especially the outside, especially the lines of my lips. Mm. So it has like a lemony smell taste to it. I don't really care. I don't like smells and tastes of things. So I would have been fine with it being kind of like blank in that category, but I guess, you know, she wanted to put a little something in there. All right, so let's check out this shade Nana in outdoor lighting. So now let's check it out in indoor lighting. So next we're going to try Shushu. I love Shushu. Shushu. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. Shushu. Okay. Next is the shade Shushu, and this is going to be a pale pink. All right, sorry, there's like, sorry guys, at least really noisy. All right, here's that beautiful little paddle of it. So I wanted to show you guys, I swear this actually picks up a perfect amount, at least for my lips, of product. It's not too much and it's not too little product. Of product, of product. So See, it's a pale pink. It kind of with this lighting looks like I just ate like a really big piece of greasy, greasy chicken. Like, <laughs> I hope so, so. But it's a pretty color. It feels good. It's very thick. Actually, this hue reminds me of. Hold on. This hue reminds me a little of jellyfish. The formulation is similar to Kosas, their wet lip oil gloss, which you guys know I love. And I feel like this kind of is similar to this, or maybe not. Yeah, this one has, of course, a different, has more pigmentation. If you own the Kosas wet lip oil gloss, it feels a little similar on the lips. And that's not a bad thing, because this is my favorite lip gloss. So this is coming in. I'm liking these lip glosses by Gucci. I don't know if they're coming in second. They're not third, so they're like 
fighting for first place. All right, so we're gonna go and check out Shushu in Shushu Shushu in outdoor lighting. And of course, I'm using my lip suede um, compact with my four beautiful lip suede hues. All right, let's see. Let's get you out of here. So now let's check it out in indoor lighting. So now let's check out Shushu in outdoor lighting. Next is Nunu, and Nunu is this beautiful, soft coral. It has like a beachy feel to it. Oh my God, I love the shade coral. I really do. Coral looks so good on so many different skin tones. My mom is like a reddish brown skin tone. Coral looks so good on her. I love coral as well. So let's check out Nunu. That paddle goes on perfectly. so pretty. Let's check Nunu out in indoor lighting as well as outdoor lighting. So next is Garcon and this is a beautiful kind of your lips but better. The colors listed is just bitten. I actually really like this hue. I think this shows up more on my pout. So with the first three, they're a little more pale, a little more subdued but beautiful. I would put them, I would use them on their own as well as toppers. You can definitely use the lip suede first and then put any of the liquid lip balms on top. And this is supposed to be a nice universal hue as well. Honestly, they should all be. Yeah, yeah this is, this is perfect. Yeah, it's like my lip color, but better. Oh, and don't mind this. This is just a um, part of my mustache. So <laughs> if you see a little hair waving at you, that's mine, my mustache. His name is Alfonso. This is so pretty. This is, we have a lot of race cars or fancy fast cars in our neighborhood and they like to like rev, rev, rev and just loud. All right, that's a beautiful hue. So let's check out Garcon in indoor lighting as well as outdoor lighting. So next is going to be the shade Ma Pousse, and this is going to be a, it's listed as a raspberry lolly, and this is a brightening shade. It's very beautiful. My window. I feel like out of all the lip glosses, this feels thinner than the other ones for some reason. So let's check out my poos, my poos, my back. Okay, let's check out my poos in outdoor lighting as well as indoor lighting. So last but definitely not least is Pep Squeak, and this is a brick red, and it is of course a complexion brightener. Look at that. I love. Such a beautiful color. Oh yeah, it's beautiful. Usually I don't like very bright red glosses, but this one, it's a beautiful, just kind of, it's a great brick, but it's not like, rah, it's not like all in your face. I absolutely love it. So let's check out Pipsqueak in indoor lighting as well as outdoor lighting.
And here are the swatches in indoor lighting. So we're going to go top to bottom. And the first one is going to be Nana. The second swatch is Nunu. Third, Choo Choo or Choo Choo. <laughs> the fourth is Garçon. And the fifth one down is Mapoose, and the last one is Pipsqueak. And then here are the swatches in outdoor lighting. So from top to bottom, Nana, Nunu, Shushu, Garçon, Mapoose, and the bottom hue swatch is Pipsqueak. So... If you own Kosas Wet Lip Oil Gloss, you'll understand the texture of Westman Atelier's Liquid Lip Balm. But I noticed that even though Kosas Lip Oil Gloss is thicker, the same it, it, it feels the same on the pout. Um, and I know Kosas is a little less of a steep <laughs> moolah situation. Now, I find all the lighter tones they're beautiful. I am in love with Shushu, but you can find dupes for them a little easier. But the hue that really has my number that I absolutely adore and I feel great when I put it on is Garçon. Garçon, hands down, is my lips, but better. It is incredible. It is my go-to. Hipsqueak is gorgeous as well, but Garçon is just puts me in a great mood, okay? It puts me in a fantastic mood. I love these lip glosses, but I don't think you need all of them. So I would go with Nunu, the beautiful soft coral, as well as Garçon, because it's your lips but better. It's incredible. And Pipsqueak. It's that beautiful kind of casual little pop of brick red on your pout. You can also layer these glosses on top of the lip suede if you own it. The packaging is really beautiful. It's heavy, it's sturdy, it's functional with the window. I know how much I've been using. Um, I know when to get another one. These are $38. But I do, I also enjoy the fact that the packaging is kind of gender neutral. Dudes can have this, you know, whatever floats your boat, you know. Um, girls, dudes, it's not even age specific. It's just chic as you know what I'm saying? But yeah, if you have any questions, please leave them down below. Press the bell for notifications. And you can find me on Instagram as well as Twitter at 555. Subscribe, stay in touch. Thanks so much for your time, guys. Bye.